I wasn't a traditional student, you know, starting um, after my first year, but that didn't cancel out the possibility for college for me, just because I had other life choices that I wanted to make and all these different sort of directions I wanted to try, didn't mean that I didn't go, get to go to school because I had this campus here in my hometown that was available and classes at a variety of times and in a variety of areas and um, a surprising amount of choices. I didn't think there would be as many as there were, but there is. Um, that helped me to get to achieve that goal that I had since I was, you know, before I can even remember so having a college degree and that's always been super important to me to have and so I got to do that because of OSU Tulsa, whereas if there was, you know, there's a more expensive private university here in town that I wouldn't have been able to afford and plus their classes are mainly during the day and I was working and so um, OSU Tulsa helped me to achieve that. College story is, is strange. I started out as an architecture major at OSU Stillwater, quickly learned that that wasn't for me, and came back to Tulsa to go to TCC and majored, I got an associate's degree in English there, decided to go to, back to OSU Stillwater to do their English program, and met my husband, no longer wanted to live in Stillwater, was ready to come back home and be with him. This campus being here in Tulsa and where it is, um, was convenient from where I live. It's a convenient drive. It didn't take long to get here. And um, going home at, in the evenings or during the day whenever my classes were wasn't a problem. And um, just being close to downtown, there's an energy about that it, that's exciting. And I think that for anyone who's doing a lot of interviewing or interning downtown, that that connection there is great. Um, you know, maybe one of the unsung qualities about this campus is its proximity to our central business district so I think that that could be of use to a lot of students. Starting from OSU Tulsa and being an American Studies major I think um, that program is so intensive on research and reading and writing and, and learning where to look for stuff and how to think that that has been invaluable in my work both as a journalist and as a blogger and just a writer in general and um, a proponent of a city that has a very rich and varied history and being able to um, talk about that with a variety of people and to get people excited about that and sort of market Tulsa back to Tulsans. Um, what I learned here at OSU Tulsa in the American Studies program has been key to be able to doing those things. I think it's really exciting to have just a university in the downtown area. I, I don't know a lot of cities that can boast that and I think that that's something that um, maybe Tulsa could even flaunt a little more than it does um, a lot of the time, but um, it's a treasure to have a center of education on at the edge of a, a downtown, a revitalizing downtown like what we have. That's, what's, that's, what, that's when I get excited is when people get down here and see what is here for the first time. That, that's incredible to me. One of, one of the first, um, Drillers baseball games that I went to after the stadium opened this spring or last spring now um, What we parked here at OSU Tulsa in the parking lot because the campus provides free parking for people who are going to the games And I thought oh my gosh, it would be so fantastic to have one of the earlier classes You get done just in time to walk down to Greenwood grab dinner and go to a baseball game and I think that's incredible. I, I really love the idea of that and um, uh, I think that that's one of the things you can do and you know for anyone looking for nightlife the Blue Dome District offers that it just about at every turn it's a small district and it's compact it's walkable and it's lined with restaurants and bars and different things to do so um, and that's just right across the tracks from One Oak Field it's, it's really easy access from this campus no car necessary Something I always appreciated about this campus is its beauty. It's a beautiful campus. It's new and it's in the shadow of downtown. From these windows here in North Hall, you can see the skyline, which is sort of a trademark of our city. And the beauty of the campus and the energy that it pulls from downtown proper, I think, make this, makes this place really special. It's sort of a, a it's one of the gems of downtown. And it's funny when someone drives through this campus for the first time. I remember when 
um, my husband came through for the first time. He said, wow, this campus is really gorgeous. And he went here for a semester or two and said, everything here is top notch. You know, the technology is right up to date with, you know, other places I've been. And so it's, it's easy to appreciate from that aspect. I'm sort of jealous of the students here now because there's so much opportunity to be able to be part of the revitalization of downtown and the growth of the Greenwood and the Blue Dome districts without the need for you know transportation or a whole lot of money to spend on entertainment. It's an exciting time right now um, that was just sort of on the cusp of happening when I was here and if I were a student here you know starting just now I would do whatever I could to live that up and to soak every bit of that in because um, and to be a part of it somehow, you know, in any way that I could because right now it's there's sort of this opportunity or the ground floor of something big, I think, and this is a chance to later be able to say, I was part of that, you know, and that's, um, that's not something that a lot of people can say and it's sort of a once in a lifetime opportunity.